Oh. <laughs> this is a different group. My heart is beating. I'm Yeti. So I did my discovery and then you guys told me I needed to watch the storylines. So I watched one and two. And to be honest, as someone that loves meanings and messages, I got my fill, but I met my match. <laughs> and so we're like, Whoo. okay, I get it. So I want to go back to their music, listen to their songs. And do you know what's funny? I was filming today and this wasn't on the cards, but I was like, oh, I really want like vocals. And I thought of Espo, which is really weird because I haven't really known them that long to even feel that kind of attachment. But I was like, okay, yeah, I want to go to them for vocals. So I'm really hoping that this set of songs are going to like that craving. You know, like when you have that, that craving for something, it's like, I want that. Thank you for all of your comments. Some of you have been saying lots of things about I'm pausing too much and just feel the music, this, that and the other. A, that's not how we do it here, <laughs> sorry. And B, clearly their messaging and their whole like ulterior concept is such a major part of who they are. So if I'm trying to discover them and just like skipping past that stuff, that doesn't make sense. That's not what I'm gonna do. Like I think that would just be quite rude of me actually. I'm gonna take them all in, try and like unpick all of them and like understand what makes Esper Esper and what makes them tick and what they want to present to me. Um, so like, stop with those comments. <laughs> hey, hey. Uh, you wanna feel the vibe? Don't I'm feeling and loving and then imagine. Jackie Polly looks like tiny with cowboy's destiny. She can put her hand up to sit down and move your butcher could come over. This is so different already. different already we've got them um in like that different environment where it's definitely feeling like more of a departure from the whole ai thing that they usually do i will say though like when they shifted to this concept and i first saw her i like thought it was ai again i don't know when i'm gonna get used to her face and her presence and all of that um but even like her singing as a rapper right there's two rappers two singers even as a rapper that she's that talented with her vocals i feel like maybe i I need to stop calling her the rap she's also the dancer isn't she oh why wouldn't you be confident when you have this talent you look like that oh the lyrics as well are like a departure This is a different group. They're like in very edgy environments and clothings, and then they're also having this like um, a bit more standard kind of K-pop like choreographies and things like that like it feels very different and i like that i like that they can do the um craziness of the concept and all of that and draw you into it but they can also do separate songs where i haven't heard navis once or black mamba or anything like that it, it seems like much more of a, a kind of maybe like a romance song uh, and they're delivering it in that way and i'm just honestly seeing them in a new light the beats. It's like synth, isn't it? It's like flute. Oh, nice! What? The charisma represented in that wig was a lot. Her run as they did the roll. Ah! 
I love this song is really nice. And they're all butterflies. Look at this black mamba. Look, we're taking a moment for the shape here. Uh, the one in the front. Come on. These are Like, so grammatically, the English in this chorus isn't making sense. You would say, do you want to go upside down? Do you want, uh, what is it? They said something about feeling so good. Um, it's like they're missing verbs that you would need in order for it to make sense. So I don't know if this is just accidental that they've prepared the song in Korean and then somehow the translations in English are not quite adding up. But I feel like SM is so focused on an international audience that surely they would pay attention to that as well and check. So maybe there is actually something in the lyric. And for, <laughs> for me, when the way the lyrics are structured, it's... When you say it, um, the way the lyrics are structured, it may be completely wrong, but the way it's structured, it's feeling to me like it's much more um, innuendos <laughs> that they're referring, referring to um, make it feel good. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not going into it, I'm too shy for that. It feels like an indie window. That pop and slide. <laughs> They're a butterfly, they want to free. They want to be free. She stopped for a rap and then was just like, I'm continuing from where I left off. I'm not gonna like reclimb again. We're just we're just keeping that same level. Damn! Wow. But we got the AIs again, but it's more subtle. Oh, guys, them singing in unison together makes you really realise the variety in their voices. Mm. That was really nice. That last phrase was really, really nice. I like that the AIs aren't, like, um, over in that song. It's like a B-side, right? Give me vocals. Uh... Oh, they're so soft-looking. Beautiful. Oh. As it like went deeper and deeper.
Oh, the Rons in this is much. Of their voices are matched by the subtle and softness of their faces it and their expression <laughs> Guys, I've been taken somewhere else this was stunning it's so airy it's is it forever it could even be dreams come true like it's just it feels like a dream they've created with their voice and their expressions they've created this like separate world they do that very well when it comes to like more of their impact songs but it's so good to see and hear that they do it with their ballads as well are you hearing those runs that's mad they're not having to belt songs out in their impact high impact songs they're belting songs out to like have an effect they're creating lots of contrast and it's like flipping here and there and even within their ballads they can create that impact and take you to a different world without doing all of those kind of techniques they're just keeping it like solidly within their voices, the talent in their voices. Oh, her voice is shining here. Oh no. That's... Look, rappers doing falsettos like that. This is what I wanted from the last song. Them singing in unison is so nice. They're not even harmonizing, it doesn't sound like, but they're just because there's um because there is already that variety in their voices, it's just sounding like this level. Their fans, for their fans. Oh. <sighs> the fact that she, the fact that she doesn't give you warning when she slips into that register is just, guys, like so much is happening in my heart and my brain right now. This choreography and expression is so natural for her. She's got it. Her voice is quite um, airy.
I'm actually speechless. Oh, oh, okay. Maybe in the comments I'll like discuss what I liked about that. Wow. Okay, this is their Pink um, Coachella performance. She's really mad if they're that young, like early in their career to be doing Coachella. It's this is incredible. The drums and the claps, nice. Nice. <laughs> Did she say gorgeous? You are. Queen B, gorgeous. Oh, they are all these adjectives every single day. They're too hot. Wow. Nice. Pop. Yeah. I haven't seen them live yet. This is good. It's good to see this energy transferring on stage. Nice. To see the one on the end. She's really playing with it. I think I'm going to watch the rest of their Coachella performance because I want to see how they translate live like this whole like thing that is around them uh, all of their like energy of the AI and their songs and things and that I, I want to see how that's translated and also their chemistry like I want to see that chemistry because in their music videos it's very much like they're playing different characters that are quite separate so you don't always get the unity I think the first song I really got that was um, in uh, the last song like forever you're getting a lot more unity a lot more like interactions with each other uh okay so life oh it's english version so i don't need subs okay cool what's the are they all english speakers <laughs> All of this discussion, talking about nothing you'd ever said in my face. You think you were the gospel, but they're only trouble. Bro! All of this discussion, talking about nothing. Is. Rubber shouldn't sound like this. All of this discussion, talking about nothing you'd ever said in my face. No, that last part! But they're only trouble, I ain't got the time to waste. You need to get away, cause life's too short. You must be far out of mind, cause you're really good. The flutter at the beginning of how soft it was. You need to get away, cause life's too short. You must be far out of mind, cause you really take the nose and somewhere else. Cause you've got to realize, do it me regardless, and I don't care. Nice! Don't I'm having all this fun, so why would I ever stop? This attitude in a very girly way. What's this? Um, I'm putting the English as well because I know I'm going to be distracted by like the level of like the way they're singing already. Oh, they're surrounded by all the expressions and emotions. Some people so mean, all the other songs scream when we're trying to live our lives. Why you gotta be so vicious, be about your business, instead of getting up in my... Like, when Impa 
facts with lyrics and meanings join with a voice is mad this is the right choice this is an absolute right choice that i made today like they regardless of what they're singing about they have such depth in their meaning and you can see like they are quite clearly talking about them as a group and like things that people are saying obviously being like in this era you're having so much people talking on social media she kind of mentioned that at the beginning that is very much like people's opinions and like why do you care like if you don't like a song you don't like a song if you don't like them you don't like actually no no <laughs> there's no reason not to like people but if you have like legitimate criticism say it in a nice way and then move about your business like it doesn't need to get personal absolutely Cutting people with vocals. Yes. I don't care. I'm so into her. The way she shifts into like salt. You are wasting your time. The press control. And this is like a call to action for us to join in. Guys, that's the isn't that the lift from girls as well? I love this song. This might actually be oh I was gonna say this might be one of my favourite songs and then I remembered forever. And um Savage. Ooh Tell me your favourite songs from them. I'll decide after after I've listened to all of this. We're back to impact. Oh. They do those um hip rolls so well. I didn't hear in the I didn't know before that she had done that, like little ad lib. She's really like um she seems very unique, like she's really got her own kind of style and attitude that she delivers on these songs. Is she gonna be the most rebellious? I love the way that she dances. I love that here that they I, um that they enhance her rap with these moves with the kicks on the feet. Oh, uh.
Meta Universe, Kung to Net, Chicken Parallel World, Moto John, Check out Emily Carter, part of my heart. Only Gong Gamma, I'm gonna sell, Chill, and I'll chill, Kerbal Sona, Age of Money, got to the two, Kill, Hey, Little Man. Yes, I'm really gonna tell you, Anna. We go get the devil to do that. Do you know what? The only thing that I will say about this, we're honest on this channel, so don't get offended. I'm always going to say it in a nice way or um, respectful, at least. The only thing is that I think, um, given like those chords that they have in this song, that they are so like striking and are, like boom, boom, like especially that part, um, that I would want their moves to be sharper and I would want them to be slightly more like um, strong and aggressive with it, you know? Like I would want to see that. I don't know if um, it's some of it might just be like as they kind of develop as they get older all of that that might come um or it's a case of because they are keeping that ai image and that whole like concept that they're not giving it all that i would like want from um the way that this song is structured and the intensity that they often have in their music videos it's not as present here. <laughs> Oh, my part's coming. Hey, girl! I told you, this girl. I have to watch her. She's always giving something. Woo! I wish she did that so calmly. No, the actual wish she did that so calmly. Like, she, like she split her legs. But she did it as if she was just doing this. Hey. That was so sharp. I bend down. these two like vocalists are just having some sort of battle it's like back and forth back and forth we have no time to breathe <sighs> <laughs> Who still dislikes this song? Please. What's that? What's that? The rapper? Okay. Wait. What? Uh, I need to, I need to stop doing like rapper and all of that because quite clearly they don't abide by those rules. That is actually mad. <laughs> That's actually mad. I love that, guys. Let me know what I should do next. I know that they are quite new, so they probably don't have lots of songs or covers or things like that out. But please let me know what else they have. See you later. Bye.